Amazing to be here at this wonderful venue, um, one of my favorites in the world, and I am so used to playing here at night, but it's actually so wonderful to be playing in daylight here and seeing the ocean out here. Uh, my name is Hanukkah Castle, this is Mike Block, and uh, we are joining you tonight to play a bunch of music. Um, I play mostly Irish and Scottish music, so sorry. I play mostly Scottish music, um, although we did start out with an Irish tune there that was called The Whistler from Rossley, and then we went into some tunes from Cape Breton Island. As many of you know, Cape Breton uh, is a place where a lot of Scottish people immigrated to, and uh, so we played a Strass Bay and some reels from Cape Breton, and uh, so, so far we've played some reels and some Strass Bays, and now we're going to play some jigs, and uh, Mike, do you want to tell them about the first jig? Yes. Uh, we're going to play a set of jigs. Um, the second one is a traditional folk jig by uh, a friend of ours from uh, Quebec in Canada, sort of a Quebecois style jig. But I'm going to, um, before that, I'm going to play a solo jig um, from a little country called Germany. Thank you. 
Thank you so much for that applause. That was a set of jigs. Um, I was being a bit playful. That first jig from Germany is actually um, from the second suite for solo cello written by Johann Sebastian Bach. Um, any cellist who um, you know is allowed to own an instrument has learned those pieces. And it's, it's been really cool you know, diving into folk music and learning about jigs from Hanukkah. Um, to see the connections because those um, movements of the Bach cello suites are based on dances and the, the jig, as Bach calls it, is a part of each one of those suites. So we really enjoyed finding the connections between those two approaches to the jig. Um, now we're going to come back to America. We're going to sing you um, a beautiful folk ballad um, called Don't That Road Look Rough and Rocky. Darling, I have come to tell you Though it almost breaks my heart
And now we are going to turn the stage over to Mike Block. Well, I'm going to sing you one more song. Um, this is a, a special song for me. Uh, it's actually a Bob Dylan song. And um, I originally recorded this in collaboration with a Kora player from Nigeria, uh, Tunde Tigede. And, uh, you know, we kind of were exploring all sorts of contrapuntal and, um, you know, vibey textures. And then I ended up adding a bunch of cello overdubs to the studio version. And, and now, when I attempt to sing this song by myself, I, I try and uh, capture both the, the, the qualities of the kora, the, the African harp, as it's sometimes called, um, with this sort of, you know, studio um, approach of, of string overdubs. And it's just a really beautiful song that feels um, always, um, always applicable, no matter what time we're in. And uh, it's really about kind of offering up music um, to the world as sort of the human, you know, um, counterpart to, to what nature throws at us. And it's a beautiful song by Bob Dylan called Lay Down Your Weary Tune.
washed as white and strong The water smooth ran like a hand And like a harp did hum Lay down your weary tune Lay down, lay down the songs you strum Rest yourself neath the strength of strings can hope to harm no voice can hope to harm no voice can you Hanukkah it occurred to me um, right as I was starting that song the second verse references the ocean and uh, I was just kind of taking in the the breathtaking view here to get to sing that song while literally confronted with by nature uh, is very very special it's great to sing that song in this space what do we have next Hanukkah Well, we're going to follow that beautiful piece with uh, a couple of jigs here. Uh, Mike plays a lot of music from some non-Celtic cultures, and I play a lot of music from Celtic lands. And so uh, we'll let you, the listeners, decide who wrote which tune, but we each wrote one of these tunes. And the first one is called The Important Thing Is, and the second tune is called Tidga.
Well, that was a beautiful tune called The No Peggio's Waltz that was written by a good friend of ours uh, from Finland. His name is Antti Jarvala. And uh, we have had such an amazing time playing today. Uh, it's really great to be back here playing music in this beautiful space. And uh, so we're going to play one more set of tunes for you. This is a Shetland tune. Shetland is an island off the northeast coast of Scotland, between Scotland and Norway. Uh, I can't speak with the Shetland dialect, but uh, the rough translation of this tune is, you've been gone for a long time, and I've kind of missed you. Uh, <laughs> and then we'll end uh, the set and the show with a tune that Mike wrote called The Moose Escapeth. So thank you so much for joining us. Uh, we hope you can dance a little tune in your house that you're listening to these tunes. And uh, thank you so much for supporting the music scene here. <laughs> 